Starship V3 is on the horizon, bringing with it the powerful Raptor 3 engine, considered to be the heart of SpaceX's next generation of flight. This new engine has already delivered impressive test results, showcasing major gains in thrust, efficiency, and reliability. Raptor 3 marks a bold leap in rocket engineering, setting the stage for a new era of high-performance reusability. So just how powerful is it? Well, let's find out in today's episode of Great SpaceX. It has been many days since Flight 11, the final mission of Starship V2. This historic flight marked both the end of an era and the dawn of a new chapter in SpaceX's journey toward full reusability and interplanetary travel. The transition to V3 introduces a wide range of major improvements, but among them, the Raptor 3 engine stands as one of the most highly anticipated advancements. During the Flight 11 livestream, SpaceX shared a remarkable glimpse of the this next-generation engine in action. In a 27-second video, the company showcased two separate tests, one for the sea level variant and one for the vacuum version. Though brief, these tests demonstrated both the immense power and refined engineering that define Raptor 3. The sea level engine was the first to be revealed. As ignition began, viewers could see a layer of frost forming near the top of the engine, an effect enhanced by its sleek, black exterior, and simplified design. This visual detail, while striking, also reflects the engine's efficiency in managing cryogenic propellants. Beneath the frost, the Raptor 3 unleashed an extraordinary amount of thrust, reaching an incredible 280 tons. This represents a major step forward, surpassing the performance of Blue Origin's BE-4 engine, which was once considered a strong competitor in the Methalox category. Raptor 3's demonstration also highlights highlighted its enhanced gimbal capability. The engine appeared to be mounted on a structure similar to Starship's engine bay, allowing it to pivot freely during operation. This flexibility enables the engine to continuously adjust its direction without losing thrust, which is essential for precise flight control. These movements will be critical during various phases of flight, from liftoff to orbital insertion, payload deployment, and controlled re-entry. In the future, this same precision will be crucial for complex maneuvers such as in-orbit refueling or deep space navigation. Following the sea level test, SpaceX revealed the Raptor vacuum engine, a variant specifically designed for operation in the vacuum of space. This may have been the first public demonstration of a Raptor vacuum test and it did not disappoint. During its short run, the engine achieved more than 300 tons of thrust, reaching a peak of 306 tons, making it the most powerful liquid fueled engine engine of its kind to date. Although it lacks the ability to gimbal, the extended nozzle design amplifies its efficiency in space, allowing it to deliver sustained power where atmospheric pressure is non-existent. While the sea level engines are built for flexibility and control, the vacuum variant is focused purely on raw performance. Together, they form a complementary pair that will drive Starship's next phase of development. These tests, even though short, have already built tremendous excitement for the upcoming V3 flight. Light. It's worth noting that the video SpaceX shared represents only small segments of each test. In reality, each engine test can last several minutes, pushing the systems to their limits under extreme pressure and temperature. However, the true measure of Raptor 3's capability will come in an official flight. Only during a full launch will these engines face the combined stresses of heat, vibration, and aerodynamic forces while working in unison. The upcoming static fire test of Booster S-39, expected to take place soon will provide a critical step toward that goal. The following flight, Starship Flight 12, will be even more significant, as it'll test not only Raptor 3's performance but also its resilience during re-entry. There are many challenges ahead, but SpaceX has reason to be confident. The company has made extraordinary progress with Raptor 3, both in performance and design. The most obvious improvement is in thrust. The sea level version has increased from 230 tons in Raptor 2 to 280 tons while the vacuum version has reached 300
106 tons. This makes Raptor 3 the most powerful Methalox engine ever developed and among the strongest liquid-fueled engines in the world. This achievement effectively places SpaceX ahead of its closest competitors. For some time, Blue Origin's BE-4, with its 250-ton thrust output, gave the company a slight advantage in engine performance. That is no longer the case. With Raptor 3, SpaceX has reclaimed the top position, setting a new benchmark for rocket propulsion technology. Yet what makes Starship's design so powerful is not just the increase in thrust per engine, but how all 33 engines on the Super Heavy booster work together. When combined, they produce more than 9,000 tons of thrust at liftoff, which is approximately 2.7 times greater than the legendary Saturn V rocket that carried astronauts to the moon. Still, this is only the beginning. According to Musk and the latest technical updates, SpaceX aims to push beyond 10,000 tons of total thrust with future iterations, beginning with Starship V4. To achieve that, each engine will need to generate around 330 tons of thrust, pushing the limits of rocket engineering even further. Raptor 3 also powers the Starship spacecraft itself, generating over 1,700 tons of total thrust across its configuration. This immense capability will play a key role in future missions to the Moon, Mars, and potentially beyond. One of the most significant improvements in Raptor 3 lies in its simplified design. This version was engineered to reduce complexity by eliminating small, failure-prone components and replacing them with larger, more integrated systems. Bolted flanges and screws, which previously introduced risks of leaks or heat accumulation, have been replaced by welded joints. This change not only increases reliability, but also reduces weight, a crucial factor for efficiency. The difference is substantial. Raptor 3 now weighs approximately 1,525 kilograms, compared to 1,600 kilograms for Raptor 2 and nearly 2,000 kilograms for the earliest version. Despite the weight reduction, it is far more powerful and durable. Another key advancement is the addition of an active cooling system, which helps the engine perform reliably under extreme heat and pressure. Because of this, Raptor 3 no longer requires an external heat shield which eliminates unnecessary mass. The saved weight can now be used for additional payload capacity, meaning Starship version 3 can carry over 100 tons into orbit, significantly more than its predecessor. This improvement also made it possible for SpaceX to remove one of the heaviest components from the previous version, the external heat shield. The heat shield was originally designed to protect the engine from thermal damage, but it also added significant mass. With the new active cooling system, that extra layer is no longer necessary. Eliminating it not only reduces weight but also improves overall flight efficiency. However, the advantages of Raptor 3's simplified design extend far beyond performance and flight. Its influence can be seen throughout every stage of SpaceX's operations, beginning with production. Simplicity is the key to scaling up manufacturing, and SpaceX has already demonstrated how this principle drives progress. When transitioning from from Raptor 1 to Raptor 2, the company reduced the production time from more than 11 days per engine to only two, and later to just a single day. Raptor 3 takes this even further, with an even cleaner and more integrated structure that eliminates unnecessary parts and simplifies assembly. SpaceX is rapidly advancing Raptor 3 production with automation and modern manufacturing like precision welding, robotics, and large-scale 3D printing, driving faster, more consistent, and cheaper output. Simplified design cut costs and boosts reliability, enabling true rapid reusability. Unlike Raptor 2, which needed extensive maintenance, Raptor 3's streamlined build allows quick inspection and relaunch. Musk envisions super heavy boosters flying hourly and starships daily, a goal made feasible by this engine's efficiency. Yet, even with its groundbreaking progress, Raptor 3 is not without its challenges. 
The full flow staged combustion cycle that makes it so efficient is also notoriously complex. This system demands absolute precision at every stage, as even the smallest misalignment or imbalance in fuel flow or combustion could lead to catastrophic failure. Its advantages, greater efficiency, better cooling, and optimized performance with cryogenic fuels come at the cost of extreme engineering difficulty. Every valve, pump, and chamber must operate in perfect synchronization. Moreover, simplicity often comes with trade-offs. To achieve a cleaner and lighter design, SpaceX has increasingly relied on integrating smaller components and employing advanced welding techniques instead of traditional bolts and flanges. This method enhances performance and reduces weight, but it introduces new challenges when repairs are needed. If a problem arises inside the engine, it may not be as simple as unbolting a section for inspection or replacement. Instead, Technicians might have to cut into the engine body itself, an approach that is time-consuming and potentially risky. For a company pursuing rapid reusability and turnaround times measured in hours, this could become a significant obstacle if not properly mitigated. Still, these issues are part of the natural evolution of groundbreaking technology. Every iteration of Raptor has brought its own lessons, each engine a stepping stone toward the ultimate goal of reliable, affordable, and frequent spaceflight. Space SpaceX now stands at the threshold of a major transformation. The upcoming Starship V3, powered by Raptor 3, represents more than just another upgrade. It symbolizes a new era of propulsion, reliability, and capability. The next flight, Starship Flight 12, will mark the debut of this upgraded engine in real conditions. Whether it launches in December or early next year, it'll be a decisive moment for the program. Success would validate years of refinement and risk-taking, potentially unlocking rapid reusability and expanding payload capacity to unprecedented levels. With Raptor 3, SpaceX isn't just aiming to improve a rocket, it's redefining the future future of interplanetary travel. And when the first V3 vehicle roars to life, the world will witness just how far human engineering can go when ambition meets relentless innovation. That said, this has been Kevin with Great SpaceX. Don't forget to like the video and subscribe if you haven't already to stay up to date with yours truly on the latest milestones in SpaceX's journey. Thank you so much for watching, and always remember, curiosity, imagination, and inspiration will follow you so long as you keep looking up.